Hey guys, how y'all doing tonight? Random one here. I'm out at St. Thomas Raceway Park, which would normally be a street legal Friday night, run what you brunk kind of thing. But no, tonight is the first weekend of Hot Rod Reunion Roland PR Ontario Nostalgia Drag Racers. And it's pretty much that feel of a test and tune night going on tonight. So stick around. We got some racing coming your way. You guys are going to want to see some of these machines that are out here tonight. I've already been recording, but you guys will see that in a minute. We got an Audi R8 with a Lamborghini V10 in it. I'm pretty sure there's a Lamborghini V10 in it, not? All kinds of good stuff. We got a V8 powered Sunfire that is just kicking butt out here tonight. You guys have no idea what you're missing if you're not getting out here enjoying it. To get things started, I already did a walk around the pits. Have a look at that footage and then we'll jump into some racing. Added little bonus. Look at this thing. This is a little 12 horse riding lawnmower engine. Oh, I hope we get to see that road. That's awesome. All right, I'm here with the owner, driver, operator of yep. Little Bullies, Kevin. Hey, how you doing, folks? <laughs> Kevin's gonna give us a few quick words about this amazing clean machine here. Hello, thank you very much, Andrew. Uh, a 1932 Ford, all steel body, five window coupe. Uh, it's been heavily modified. Uh, we run, all we do is drag race it now. We're not on the street at all. Uh, we've got a small block Chevy engine in it, automatic GM transmission, Ford rear end in it. Uh, we're running low tens in the quarter at a, just shy of 130 miles an hour. Uh, for you metric folks, that'd be 0.4 of a kilometer. We're running 260 kilometers an hour. And, Quick. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> we're having a lot of fun. Um, it's still on pump gas. We're not running anything exotic, carbureted, all naturally aspirated. Starting out, starting out, we were driving it on the street of the hot rod. We were doing car shows, cruise nights, stuff like that. And then we kind of progressed and got it into a uh, pro street uh, configuration and then we ended up drag racing it. The insurance company decided, no, no, no more street for you. <laughs> so we bring it to the track and, and have a lot of fun with it. So it's been great. We've been doing this for about three years now and having Amazing. a ball. Like it's, it's one thing to show these guys sitting at home, right? Mm -hmm. Now how much power did you say roughly? Uh, somewhere in the neighborhood of 600 of roughly to the, the crankshaft. It's hard to explain to them at home. I could show them on camera, right? But to be standing beside the machine and actually... And then we'll be seeing it going down the strip and you're saying 10 and a quarter. Yeah, yeah, low 10s, yeah. So yeah. Go to 10, 10. It's fast. It's not yeah. something you'd feel every day. No, no, that's for sure. And it pulls the front wheels off about six inches off the ground if the track's fucking good, so... We're gonna have to try and well. get a shot of that <laughs> so I can get you a nice still of the wheels off. That'd be awesome, that'd be awesome. Right on, yeah, well thanks for your words. It. Thanks very much, Andrew. And we'll Pleasure. see you out there yep. for sure. Good luck. <laughs> thanks now. Got love for this Super right here. That's not bad. It's got a uh, 7M GTE in it. We've done a ride along in it. Is that that Subaru we just heard? Oh, there's a speaker in the way. Left lane had it. So we decided to switch over to the filming from this side of the track tonight because the PA speakers 
kind of block that view. Vic versus a Silverado pickup. Oh, Silverado. I think I've seen this one on real life police chases. The Crown Vic usually wins. Speed coming up on the boards.
Dang, got him. Phantom 409, I heard that car in the pits. That thing is mean. It's got a DSM over there, but it's got kind of a rattle to it. another Gen 2 DSM over there. I did hear him say that it's his first time on the track, so bear with him. Everybody's got to learn.
All right, this is Mr. Lovers in the uh, pickup here. I'm thinking that's a new truck. Going against the Audi. Did he? Did he? Oh, he almost had that R8. Almost. This thing is just mean. Thirty-three mile an hour. Camera problems. better launch he would have had him. So some of you people might actually recognize it if you know the driver but those who are just kind of tuning in watching the channel this truck here belongs to this guy Ben the driver. What's... So you want to you want to tell the folks a little bit about your truck? Go stand in front of your truck. Hey. Don't worry I'll edit that part out. <laughs> See she's my baby just a 4.3 S10 I'm gonna blow it up and LS swap it. That's a good I always, idea. I always wanted to paint it, so I bought a house and now I had room to paint it. And uh, just rattle can, but you can make rattle can look good if you try hard enough. You can, you can. Hell yeah. And like, look how low that is, okay? His bumper is touching the grass. And it's not just the front, I mean, it's all the way around low. Get shot from the back. Of course, the clear tail lights. An LS swap would actually do wonders for this. But right now, you're just all about the burnout, eh? Hell yeah. Oh. Hopefully, I zoom past the other sticker quick enough.
Get sideways. Transmission's gone. That's one heck of a sticky surface, too. Some of you guys might recognize this car from the small tire shootout. Another beautiful machine. Not that one. <laughs> this one. Oh, and he's going to be facing off against that. Beauty. Make them all nervous and record them. <laughs> oh, I'm not sure it's behind me, but it sounds mean. Oh, is this Mustang? Nitrous Mustang, I heard him purging. Oh, but he wasn't quick enough. Well guys, it's getting to be quite a bit later out. Look at this field of cars right here. That's a whole lot of cars on Friday night. And yes, that was a GTR. So being that it's actually gotten dark out, it's getting harder to film. I'm probably going to end the video here. Unless I throw in some bonus clips, but it just, it's too grainy. Gotta have love for the GTR. past a certain time of night so thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed it i'll be back out here tomorrow morning so be prepared for day two of the ondr weekend hot rod reunion it's going to be a good weekend talk to you guys later